Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to use the IP locator. So what the script does is it takes a file of IP addresses and it converts it to a Google Earth file. It also generates a CSV file with information about the IP addresses. So I'll show you how to use it. There's also an optional VPN and ISP detection. So you're going to make an account on this website and get an API key. I'll show you right here. Here's an API key. Uh, you'll copy it and this is not the whole IP, API key. And you'll make a file called ipHubInfo.txt and just paste that um, API key in there. So we're just going to do locate ips.py And this will work if you don't want to use that API. So it went through our list of IPs. It generated a CSV file for our Google Earth to use. And two files have been created, locations XML and geostatus.csv. All right, now I'm going to drag the two files. And Here's what they look like. I'm going to drag them over. So we've got geostats and locations. All right. And if we go to the USA, we can see that our IPs have been mapped. And we can see that the IP also correlates to a city, or maybe it doesn't. If it ha happens in two locations, then the pin just gets two IPs added to it. And then the geostats. So this is going to have IP address, latitude, longitude, city, region. For USA, that would be state. We got a time zone. Now these two last fields, they're only going to be added if you use that API key. But if you don't use the API key, then you'll get information for the rest of them. So you get an ISP, and you'll get it if it's blocked or not. So I got these IP addresses from uh, my Nord VPN. So don't worry about using them. Nord owns them, so you're not going after a personal person. Um, but the API said, hey, this is something that's owned by a proxy or VPN. And some of them have zero, so they got through. So yeah, that's basically how you use the script